Hello everyone, this is Director Marlon Green Synchronizing the universe with positive energy If our leaders could have done a better job, trust me, they'll be doing it Hi everyone, this is Director Marlon Green And uh, I want to go over a couple of things with you all And some of these uh, you are familiar with I want to talk about the African American situation And how bad is it and what's up the real women of America what are they like and uh, I know this is just a one one sided view but I know the intricate behaviors I know the dysfunctional behavior I know uh, the patterns of inconsistency so I'm going to give it to you in a nutshell and all of you all are welcome to comment and everything else on this uh, video and uh, how bad is it, the real African American woman? How bad is it? It's pretty bad. Okay, let's talk about it. How bad is it? Really bad. They don't like us. They lie a lot. Don't speak when they should. Speak when they should not. They see racism. They experience segregation. They don't know what Jim Crow is. And so their minds are destroyed. And we have to watch out for this because white folks are going to take their word over ours, all the black men, even though they don't cook, they don't clean, they don't communicate, they just complain. 20 years later, a complaint can get all your shit took. They don't care about men's work. I'm in the Hall of Fame. I can't get no pussy. You got busters getting it from the back, bent over and all this shit. I can't get nothing. I need to get my money. They're not helping with that, but they always needing something. At 10 to 1, they expect us to help them more when it's the other way around. They throw away men's work clothes. They break furniture. They sell sex all the time. We just had an article this weekend that came out about a fraternity girl that has a good job using her job as pimping for extra money. Had guys and girls working. And uh, they are really mentally ill because they don't understand what we go through. They just understand what they go through. And the Jim Crow law says this and the master says that they gonna do it they're not gonna even question it and then the jim crow law says turn men against women and all this type of shit break, break the black woman beat the black woman make her afraid they are afraid to respect us and open us black men but they respect the white folks and then they date Arabs they date Jews they date Spanish and they date white boys to no end and then they have the nerve to try to stop my shit that's why I can't fuck with them I'm not marrying no American we can be cool we can be friends maybe business partners but that's about it because American women for the most part are not worth marrying man you're just not and so how bad is it it's pretty bad they won't talk to you only talk when you want something they don't march for us like they march for you too or me to you movement or uh, time's up movement they don't march for us like that they don't vouch for us as far as getting jobs getting opportunity getting leadership positions they don't understand they are men. They just understand what the women telling them. They want to be worshipped like Isis and, and old goddesses and stuff like that. Now, if we having a problem with God, I definitely going to have a problem with 1,500 deities from other religions. I, I don't see it. Uh, they all in the witchcraft, it's in the money, it's in the media. Jane Elliott is a good woman. Ilion Omar is a good woman. Harriet Tubman was a good leader. They have more power than men these days and don't use it the right way. They live longer than men. They get treated better than men. Less women than men in America or in jails. 
we should go back to Africa now and they just gonna have to put up with our multiple wives and our multiple girlfriends because they fuck with everybody right now and so even with good jobs they'll still be selling the pussy so what's the what's the what's the end supposed to be and this is director Marlon Green signing off on this real shit let you know what the real deal is and not just take their word for it and get screwed.